This is the type of song where you can check your own thinking in pieces. <laughs> Hey folks, welcome to the channel. I'm Dom. This is Rockin' the Country, as always, in our sixth year now. I am doing Henson Cargill. I've done a couple of Henson songs, and he passed away in 2007. Uh, but, you know, American country musician, none of my business. And this was requested by the Garrett D's and David Emsweiler. I'm wearing this in David's honor. Nothing more needs to be said. Henson Cargill. I know this is going to be good because of who requested it. Both of you guys, the Garretties and David. None of my business. It's a country bass line. Little kids sleeping with rats in the bed. Well, it's none of my business. It's been a long time since they've been fed, but it's none of my business. Well, he's going to call them out on that. Some more bad news from Vietnam, and China's playing with a great big bomb. I better take a pill to stay calm, cause it's none of my business. People are afraid to walk their own streets, but it's none of my business. Cops can't even walk on their beat, but it's none of my business. Well, this is repeated. I read about a girl, I forgot her name. She was screaming for help, but nobody came. It seems like kind of a shame, but it's none of my business. Ten more billion on the national debt, well, it's none of my business. Brilliance now. People in the slums are a little upset. That's none of my business. Kids dropping out of school looking for a thrill. Learning the laws, kill or be killed. I better take another pill, cause it's none of my business. Now the preacher's saying something about getting involved. Well, it's none of my business. He said we got troubles that we gotta have solved. Lord, that's none of my business. Now I go to church and I meditate. I don't even mind when they pass the plate. But this stuff about my fellow man's fate, well, it's none of my business. Lord, it's none of my business. You know, that was a song that was brilliantly written because he's actually saying it should be all of our business. All this stuff going wrong, it is our business. And that's what, like, uh, God, what would even be the literary device's name for this? It, I mean, irony, but that, that's not quite right. Uh, where you say the opposite, because uh, it is your business. You just point out. That's the mindset that got you into the situation to begin with, that nobody cared. You got the slums, the kids got rats in their bed, they're being underfed, China's building the bomb, the national debt's going up. He said $10 billion. It just went up by like $10 trillion in the last couple of years. I don't even know what those numbers mean anymore, but they're not good. I mean, we've built a lot of things on fake money, money that somehow is supposed to be paid back in the future, but might not. I don't know. but. People in the inner city, I mean, he said slums, and I guess slums is a fine word, too. It captures it, but it is, it is our business, but how do you do it, you know? How do you make it your business? I guess find one person in life and make a difference in their life that's not in your immediate family. That's a good start. Uh, somehow help them out, generally financially, with good advice, things like this. But the Garrett D's and David... It makes a lot of sense that you would have requested this one to see if I'd get it. And I'm pretty sure I did. It's just, it's not metonymy. It's, it's just when the opposite thing is being said to point out, this is why we're here. So on the strength of that alone and how history has repeated because human beings are human beings and it will continue to repeat. 
I'm going to come in with a straight nine. It's a song to captivate you. What's he going to say next? What's part of the problem? That's none of my business. And let's see if I'm actually thinking that way. Because you, this is the type of song where you can check your own thinking in pieces. It isn't this big grand picture that I'm a piece of crap or something like that. It's, wait, do I, do I walk by people in that situation? Or do I just read that in the news and not care about it? That kind of thing. Check your own conscience. So there it is, folks. Henson Cargill's None of My Business. He's he saying that because it is his business, and that was the point. All right. Have a great day, folks. See you on another video. Keep rocking a country.